Oh, it's falling. Catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it. All right, so I'm going to save again now in case we make any irreversible mistakes. And we're going to see how this garden turns out. And you know what's really annoying? I just realized that this is even, whereas the pathway is odd. So that's kind of frustrating, but we're just going to have to deal with that. You know, I'm just going to have this come out a little bit and that'll give us some room to expand the pathway. Weld, weld, weld. There we are. Let's see how it looks. I think it's looking pretty good so far. All right, so that's why I kind of find it a little bit annoying with the whole even and odd thing. It's like, it, it's, it's really gonna bother me that I can't just have it meet up nicely with this. So this will be the start of our journey through the garden. We go through here, get sprayed by the water. Whoop, dodge the water sprinklers. And now we can connect something right over here. What should we, I think we here we can connect like one of the central pieces. So let's go with the very first one, because I think that one deserves, because it started it all. This is the one that started this entire project. Saw this, and I was like, you guys should do a little bit more. And of course, this takes up like all of the rest of the space. It has successfully welded. So now we go through here, and then we can go on through. Oh, did I miss the thing? There we go. So now, unfortunately, we can't go this way because the solar panels are right there. We can go this way, and we can go this way. So I'm thinking... Maybe I'll put the, like, a tree or the wind... I'm gonna put the windmill over here. I'm gonna have the tree be the end. So we're gonna put the windmill over here. All right, and there we have it. We got our windmill. Check that out. All right, we walk through the garden. We got this cool area here. We can go over and take a look at the windmill. Now we can go out this way. And I have a feeling that the garden is gonna stick out in front over here. But you know what? Maybe we're just gonna have an overhang above the canteen and stuff. That's fine. So I'm curious about curving over around the solar panels. I don't know how much of a curve this is gonna give us. This is actually really wide now that I look at it. Oh boy, this might not be good. Whoa, okay. All right, what do we got going on? Oh, this is cutting it kind of close, I think. This is cutting it kind of close. I don't think we have a lot of room. Ugh, it's gonna collide. It is going to collide. You know what, let's see, do we have a, a smaller straight section? This might be it right here. This might be our saving grace by the sausage. Apparently it has a secret hatch. All right, where is this secret hatch? Oh, there we go. Whoa, do not enter, ah, okay, okay. All right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Look at that. Oh, interesting, that's a cool little secret hatch. Very interesting, so we can have a way to get back down into the base from that. We're gonna take this right here. There we go. Now we have a little bit of an archway to go through. Yep, a little bit of an archway to go through before we do this curve. And the curve will go around that way. And then we can add some more cool things to it. Uh, but we have to adjust the paint. I know adjust the paint here. I guess I, that was my fault. I didn't actually mention what color paint the original design was in. So some of you have used some different colored paints, but that's fine. No problem to repaint. All right, there we go. No problem. Okay, so now the tough part. Now we gotta start working in an area that we don't have ground to stand on. All right, so now we're gonna try, we're gonna try to use this curve. What, oh no. Oh. I may have broken the game, people. We may have broken this entire map, actually. We're gonna find out what just happened. All right, we're trying to load back in. The map might be broken, but I do have a backup from before we welded that first path on there by the sausage. So it's not too much of a progress. Uh, it, it's too, not too much of a loss of progress. Oh, here we go. The bar is full. <gasps> I can't believe this isn't broken. I really can't believe this isn't broken. And it looks like it didn't even break the windmill. Oh, it just stopped the windmill. All right, let's hurry up. So I think, what do I need to do here? I need to weld it to right over there. Oh, it's falling! Catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it, catch it! And, all right, I got it. I got it, doesn't matter if it falls now. I have it on the weld tool. Don't fall, don't fall. Uh, uh wait, which side did I grab? I don't know. I hope, I hope this is the right side. I think I got the right side here. I did it! The wrong way, no! <laughs>
I thought I had the right side. Oh, I was not paying attention to which side. I wanted it to turn that way. Not this way. Ah. Oh. Yeah, frames are so bad there. Right there. Come on, weld. Weld. This should be it. It's gonna turn to the right. It's gonna turn to the right. Yes! Okay, good. Good, we're getting somewhere. We are getting somewhere. Whew, this is tough, people. I, I, I'm thinking we're getting towards the end of the series. Not because I, we have everything finished, of course. We are, like, there's no end in sight to what we could do with this. But the frames, the lag is just getting too much to handle. So, uh, I'll, I'll tell you at the end of the episode what my plans might be for how to, uh, not really end the series, but take a break until the game gets a little bit better at handling this, if that's gonna happen. But we're gonna go use this by Baby Creeper. That's a creepy name. I don't really think it matters what side of this we use. But I just gotta grab this right here. So that's the left side of the path. Remember that left side of the path goes to the left side of the metal. I hope that this looks okay with the measurements with the solar panels, because I'm like right next to the solar panels. That's what I'm worried about right now. All right, it welded. All right, let's see how this looks. We go up here. Oh, we are plenty of space between here and the solar panels. Now I'm really curious what it's gonna look like outside of these canteens, outside of those windows. You know what, guys? I just got this feeling of like, all of these things were built by different people and look at how well everything coordinates. It all started with this section right here, and this is what it's turned into. Check it out. We're, we're going, actually, technically, it started with the greenhouse. And now we go out into here. Whoop, these these uh, sprinklers are in the way. Can we go under? Nope. Oh, we're getting sprayed with the water. We're getting sprayed with the water. Here, let's just uh, ignore the sprinklers for now. So we go out of here. Now we can even go up onto these steps. Oh, this is, I just realized this is a viewing platform of, like, the whole rest of the base. That was not intentional, but looks pretty cool. All right, and we can go down. We go out here. We can see the windmill. Oh, this all looks so great. This is a dead end. We'll have to put some type of blocker right here or something. We can go here through the archway, and if we need to, we can actually drop down into the canteen under here. Actually, just out of curious, just out of curiosity, uh, what happens if we do just delete this? Oh, that's right at the edge of the window. That is so perfect. Okay, good. Let's, uh, we'll ignore that for now. There we go. All right, we go through here. Come to this nice little archway. Here, let's turn that on. Turn these lights on, too. There we go. Got a nice little bench over here. Oh, and I just realized, look at how... this. I didn't even mean to do this, but this bench overlooks the entire map. That is fabulous. Oh man, this is turning out great. And then we go over here and we can like up here overlooks the entire map even more. And then this overlooks the rest of the base with the solar panels. And then we go through this archway. And now, you know what we can do is add the one more of that, that circular section that we haven't added yet that lets us split off into other areas. And then on, at the very end of that, we're going to add the tree, and then we can split off into two smaller areas. So let's find that circular section. All right, we've got it welded. It's looking pretty good. Even like, look, over here, we can go around the solar panels. This is actually nice. We can go out a little bit more if we wanted to. We might create a dead end here, though. I'm not sure. Uh, here, let's turn the switch on. There we go. Now we got the little lily pond doing its thing over there. All right, and I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna put the tree right over here, I think. All right, just gonna grab the left side of it. If I, I can't grab the left, really? Are you kidding me? All right, I'm gonna grab the right side of it. All right, so remember, this is the right side of the path. Right side, oh no! Oh, that is terrible. Oh man, that's exactly what I didn't want to happen. All right, take two. Grab the right side of it. And this time, let us not fall off the platform. All right, let's uh, and also not look at anything so we don't get the lag. All right, and so this is the right side, so I need to go over to there. Oh no, what have I done?
Why did I think I was in the right spot? I don't know why I thought I was in the right spot. Uh, you know what? I think, I think we can do this. I think we can just shift the whole thing over one. We can do this. We can fix this. I can fix this. No need to worry. What just, did you just see that? All right, this is, this base is making the game, the game does not know how to handle all this stuff. And I think this is a record, people. I think this is a new record on how many of your creations I've added in a single episode. So that is pretty cool. All right, so we're going to shift this whole path over by one. There we go. Let's do a little bit of that. Do a little bit of that. No problem. We got this. It's working. Use the paint tool. Just paint that back up there. Hey, it looks great. It looks just like it was supposed to be like that the whole time, right? Yeah, right. And then this is the end of this section here. We could go out a little bit more that way. We can go in a little bit more this way. And yeah, let's look at there was some small ones. Let's see if we can get one of those small ones and hook it up right there really quick. Ah, yes. We don't want to forget this. All right, the rarest of flowers. We have to keep in our in our uh, garden over here. So let me make sure I can actually weld this. Oh, I almost fell. Oh, I almost fell again. All right, so we are going to be welding it right over here. We'll just create our connecting piece just like that. No! I clicked jump and I didn't jump. It's so much lag. Perfect, look at that. We got our flowers. And, oh, look at that. Could that have been any more perfect? Ladies and gentlemen, could that have been any more perfect as far as measurements goes? I do not think so. That is amazing. All right, and we can actually probably add like an ending right here as well. We got our awesome flowers. We got that tree over there. Uh, we could probably put like a little viewing deck over here or something. But I think we're going to... I think we're going to... I think this is all we're going to add for now. So let's do a full walkthrough of what we've added to this thing. And then after we do this walkthrough, stick around please, because I have some important announcements about what, how we might be wrapping up this series. I know you're probably gonna hate to see it go. It's been a, one of the most popular series on my channel, but if you look at the frames, I don't think this base can handle much more. But I have some ideas on how we can continue going forward in other ways. So stay tuned for that. First, let's do a walkthrough. All right, so we go up here. We go into the- oh, let me get this stuff out of the way. We go into the greenhouse. We get out of the greenhouse and get annoyed by this little discrepancy here. And we walk through our sprinkler garden over here. Whoop, it's stuck under the sprinklers. We can see the rest of our awesome base that we've been working on. Let's go back down. Check out the windmill still works, despite putting it through all that stuff before. Spawning the creations on top of it. We go through here. We go through our secret little, uh tunnel and we could take a nice break on this bench taking a look at the nice view maybe spend some time and get a, get a good selfie in the gazebo yeah it's okay my character's still being weird can use these balconies for an awesome view as well oh looks like you missed a paint thing and got this balcony over here we can lower look the solar panels that we added last episode go through the archway into this section can go around the nice circle, uh, fall off the edge to our deaths over there. Go over to the tree, get some shade underneath the tree, even though there's no shade underneath the tree. And we can go around over to here, take a look at the extremely expensive and rare flowers. And don't forget the, uh, the secret, oh, where's the secret duck? There's a secret duck over there. And we could probably put an ending right here or something, or we can keep it going somewhere. I don't know. I don't know what we can do over here. But yeah, that is everything we've added. How many things did we add? At least nine creations that we've added this episode. I'm pretty sure that is a new record. All right, so we're going to stay under the tree here for now. Uh, so since the game is not really handling this very well, and so much stuff can go wrong now, there's so many moving parts, all kinds of things happening. Um, I'm thinking we're going to have to take a break until the game improves. If it, if it can even handle this in the future, I don't know. 
But what I want to do is I'm thinking about maybe starting a new series because this whole community thing where you guys get to uh, build stuff and have your stuff featured for everyone else to see. I really like that idea and it seems like you guys are enjoying it too. So I want to keep doing that. Now, what inspired this base was actually this location because we have this awesome mountain range, which uh, you guys can get in the game now too. It spawns back in. They fixed that issue. And I wanted to have something in the middle of the mountain range, and that is why we have this. So I'm thinking I want to do another themed thing where we can all start building things to that theme and uh, putting a community creation together like this. It could be inspired by a certain location, a certain tile. We could have something using like the, uh, the canyon, for instance, or we could just have something anywhere in an open space. I don't know. Let me know what kind of theme that you guys would like to see. And uh, if you see a theme that you like, make sure you give it a thumbs up down in the comment. And I'm going to look at the top rated themes down in the comments. So here's what I'm thinking for the end of this series, or at least season one of this series. We might be back for another season in the future. What I'm thinking is... I'm going to do one more episode, and it's going to be a mega episode. And what I mean, what I mean by that is it might be a little bit long. All right, so this is what it looks like from the uh, canteen, by the way. So what I'm thinking is we're going to do a mega episode where I just show off a bunch of your creations that I have not had the opportunity to show off because there are so many. I still won't be able to get them, get to them all, but let me know what you guys think of that idea. Should I just do a dedicated episode? We'll be in a completely different map so there's no lag, and I'll just go through a whole bunch of some of the awesome creations that you guys have made for this base that unfortunately we don't have the resources to add because I love the way that this thing is turning out, but the lag is getting a little bit too much. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. So that's two things for you to comment on, at least. What theme do you want to see for the next community collaboration? And for next week's episode, do you want to see a mega episode that's maybe like, you know, 30 to 40 minutes long of just showing off some of the awesome creations that you guys have made? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. This has been one of the most productive episodes. Look at this garden. It looks amazing. It's been one of the most productive episodes that we've had. I was glad we were able to at least get this much added to the base without breaking anything too much. And don't forget, we also added that awesome pool. I love the way that pool looks. It looks amazing and we didn't break anything either. Um, oh, I just figured out another thing. Another thing. Let me know if you want to do this too. At the end of the mega episode, maybe we will disconnect <laughs> the entire base from the waterfall and watch what happens if the game crashes or if the base falls, what happens to the bridges. That might be a good finale episode to season one. So let me know what you guys think of that too. This has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.